Hello there. In this video, I want to remind you of a feature of the create record action in a workflow. So I've got a contact workflow and I'm creating a deal from it. So you're probably aware of this action called create record. So I'm on the contact, as I said, then I want to create an associated deal. You get all this. I'm going to go through this in a second, in particular, this add more properties, but I've already got one I've created earlier just to save us a bit of time. So here it is, contacts, creating a deal. And I've already started creating some of these properties, copying them from the contact up to the deal. And I'm going to add another one. Let's just keep going. It's not set, it's going to be copy. And we might choose a uh, country. Okay, and we're going to choose the deal. Okay, we're copying it up to country. And that's what it does. I'm just going to say done and then it's there in place. And you might be thinking, well, hang on, why isn't that duplicating data? Why would it do that? This is actually common. And I'm not saying it has to be addresses, could be any, but address is a common one, especially if there's builders, solar dealers, or anyone that's working with customers that have multiple addresses. Uh, solar dealer, they've got a customer wants a solar quote. Okay, it's for this property. Okay, let's copy that up to the deal because their next inquiry might for for a different property. So it's actually a common use case. So why am I reminding you of all of this? Well, if you don't use this, and I don't know what the limit is, but you can put, I know I've seen lots of 10 or more properties being copied up. Doing it at the time of creating the deal saves you a lot of hassle because otherwise, after you create the record, you'll find yourself, and tell me if you've been guilty of doing this, where you copy property values up. So again, you're saying, um, uh, say, uh, say the country, you go and find it. Oh, yep, I've got to copy that up to the deal. And then it's like, is it all deals or do I use um, uh, associations? becomes a bit of a hassle. All right, so you don't want to be doing that. And then you've got to do it individually for each of these. So that's inefficient. So really the reminder, the takeaway from all of this is make sure you use this little properties, add more properties section to copy up at the time of creating the deal. hope that's helpful. It's not new, as I said, but sometimes my LinkedIn feed is only full of the brand new stuff. And I think it's time to remind us about some of the goodness that's been in there for ages and is underutilized. Let me know if that helps.